Welcome back to Afterfall. Uh, we are now, I guess, in the sewer? Can't wait till Albert gets out of there and says he never liked that sewer anyway. Now, I don't really get, though, if it's a scale model kind of city why you'd have a whole giant sewer system like this. <laughs> but... Well, you gotta water your buildings. I guess you do? Yeah, that's true, according to the shopping list, right. For for instant building, yeah. Um... So, yeah, we have to- we're still looking for Carolina. They're really proud of their flying paper in this game. <laughs> hey, you forgot we can do this? For, pretty cool, right? Hello? Where are you going? <laughs> oh, this is- apparently we somehow know this is the AID building, where we were supposed to meet Carolina, even though this is our first time in the city, and... Also, this building is not- Do you think Carolina's still doing Madden football moves to avoid the cannibals? <laughs> Probably. I hope so. Okay, so... Assuming we know this was the AID building, maybe from the relation to where the van was and everything, right? Mm -hmm. And assuming somehow we know this freight elevator goes to the roof... <laughs> what, after fall? <laughs> I agree with you, Albert. I did not expect it to be. It's like climbing a ladder. Did those explode? Hmm. Well, we're not going to find out because there's no combat. So did they put that in the game because they knew the elevator ride was taking too long but didn't have any good fix for it? <laughs> kind of lampshading or whatever. Yeah. Okay, and also, here's another puzzle. If the, there's the automatic thing doesn't work, so we have to do it the old-fashioned valve way. I, I don't know. <laughs> I have no response to that. I feel like the game, like, tries to do hallucinations, but they just randomly pick an audio clip that you've been through, <laughs> and then... Anyway, hacking minigame for no reason. And... So, remember when you mentioned the Truman Show? Yeah. You weren't super far off. Interesting. But... But there's no one doing the observing. Right. Who observes the observation room? I know. What were they observing in the city? I mean, none of it looked particularly interesting. No. They're just really proud of their fake buildings. He's looking for a light switch? Oh, look, Carolina's here, but she can't stay there any longer, so... She's going toward the shelter. Well, anyway, that's the one mission, but oh my gosh, what the heck is this? So what you're saying is that Albert will have to enter the fist? Mm-hmm. Well, that city looks a little better. Oh. My. God. <laughs> That's right, Janice from Friends. It's a cave. A cave! The whole city is a model! A life-size fucking model! I feel like this- <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this twist is supposed to hold a lot more gravity than it does, but- <laughs> Albert himself is not animated as part of the problem. Right. He doesn't match with his dialogue. Oh, fuck. So... Yeah. Um... For some reason... Which I haven't quite figured out... Yeah. Outside of the shelter, it's a cave with a life... A, a scale model of a city with cannibals in it. Yeah, so was it designed like, these cannibals need a nice home. But then who designed it, knowing that there'd be... I'd have to assume the cannibals came second, but I can't for the life of me figure out what, how this fits into anything that we've seen or done in the story of the game. Well, you heard Albert. Uh. Ma. I don't know. God. Holy shit! It's a life-size fucking model! Well, look, even he's over it. <laughs> well, anyway. You about to go fight Magus? What the? Everyone is what are you, Tommy Wiseau now? I'm looking straight at the. It's tearing me apart in a lot of ways. Fake city. But life in it was real. What are you talking about? Well, what's the fucking point? simulation of a post-apocalyptic urban environment? 
Looks more like a military testing ground than a sociological experiment. What? How? <laughs> Soldiers were training, preparing for to test the power of nuclear weapons on plastic buildings. No, Albert, that makes no sense. Where would the cannibals have come from then if it was a testing ground? Well, you need test subjects for radiation. What about the mutants? Like the giant bosses and everything. That's the radiation. Huh? Uh, well, hmm. so there you go, I guess. So this is kind of like lost in that each answer just creates a billion new questions. Yeah, but, like, in Lost, like, the questions kind of had something to do with what was going on. And... Yeah, they did relate to the plot. That does help. Yeah, this I, this doesn't really have anything to do with anything, it seems like. <laughs> it's like you find out about the origami killer, but it's while you're playing SimCity. Yeah, exactly. It's like, and the, he was the killer, and you're a killer. Oh, there was a murderer. Oh, I oh, forgot to was? tell you. Oh. Yeah, I forgot to mention that. Sorry. Oh, my God. The whole city was fake. Wait, city? <laughs> uh, I don't know how we kind of got to hear from the top of a building either, by the Is way. Is it going to be we get to the end of this level and there's a director who says, Alright, cut. <laughs> we don't know what we were thinking here, sorry. <laughs> Good job, Albert's actor name. I'm scared, Doctor. I feel like the whole world has turned against me. Thanks. Um, okay. Feeling, Doctor? Did they drop all of their audio files on the floor and pick them up in a random <laughs> sequence to put in the game? Uh, it seems like it, right? Like, I, I can't tell what the hell's going on at this part in the game. <laughs> then why not bring back the fish people? Should come in handy. What are you talking about? Where? Albert? Battery? Oh. All right. How many fucking batteries have we picked up in this game? Should come in handy if I need to power the fake city. Well, area explored. I guess that was another objective. Uh, okay. Is Albert's PDA like a million steps ahead of him? <laughs> it, it's smarter than Albert is, correct? <laughs> yes, it is. Use these containers to clear my way out of here. What are you talking about, Albert? I, I can use a container to clear my way out of here. <laughs> Oh no, the music and sound effects, but nothing's <laughs> happening. Yeah. All right. I also don't quite understand like how Albert's kind of trapped. You know what I mean? Like what? Where is he <laughs> trying to? <laughs> well, that's that then. <laughs> no, it was. Oh, okay. <laughs> it was just really bad perspective on the designer's part. <laughs> Though when we upload this, we should just end it there and say the game is over. <laughs> the end. That's the afterfall. Wait, what? How will you ever deal with that guy? Oh. Why, why were we so dramatically invested in that monster? He was invulnerable otherwise, despite precedent. <laughs> Alright, through here, and... Another battery! And ammo for the battery. So it appears that you have to power on cranes in order to use cranes to pick up containers. I guess. Okay. To smash monsters. I know that because he already explored the area. Right. <laughs> I'm surprised Albert figured all this out, really. Is but... there an enemy I'm not seeing? Yeah, right? It's... <laughs> The crane lifting sequence is the most adrenaline pumping part of the game. <laughs> Those guys we drove away from in the van finally caught up to us. Yeah. <gasps> All right, Albert. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, who cares? All right, hang on. Let me find something to drop on you. <laughs> All right, where are you in relation to me? Oh, okay, there you are. Wait, did the monster oh. trip? I, I thought it was brilliant strategy. <laughs> Like it pretended to trip. So yeah. <laughs> I gotcha. It is. That was pretty smart of it. So is this like a boss fish man that just looks like all the other fish man? No. He took a little more punishment. All right. Uh, maybe mini boss fish man. Now let's find out who the fish man really is. <laughs> oh my god. There's a fake city in this fish man. Oh my god. The whole container room is fake. Oh my god. They don't explode. It's a scale model of a. These fucking containers do not. Fucking explode! <laughs> All 
All right, music. We're past that music. <laughs> Wait. Okay. So there is a prompt here, but it's not like I guess it's on the other side actually. Or we'll something. We'll try knocking, and maybe the red barrel will answer it. Yeah. <laughs> Albert. Maybe it's an explosive barrel, or uh, it's not I guess red. it's not red. You're right. So forget that. Look, I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> Well, so I don't really get that prompt. After all these plot twists, a mere door. Oh. Like, see, again, the PDA is much smarter than Albert. Is which one? Well, why is that even an option? Like, is this like a puzzle? Nothing in this game has been a puzzle so far. <laughs> I, I know, but you have to shoot You have to shoot the right counterweight lock or else. Oh, and now the counterweight's so fake? <laughs> Fuck you, elevator! <laughs> Um, is the solution to shoot all of them? I don't. No, it was just to shoot the middle one. Oh, but it doesn't matter if you shoot the others. I guess not. Great puzzle. Yeah, I don't understand what was so, you know, wild about that that we had to go to <laughs> slow motion and everything. But they even give you the chance to skip it. <laughs> Oh, he's dead. He ragdolled. Oh, man. It's the surface. This time for real, we swear. Uh, uh, huh? Yeah. What? Now Albert realizes that he has been fake this whole time. <laughs> I think what this is supposed to signal is the, uh, he's like, like the sunlight, you know? Hmm. That ample sunlight. Never again. No, what never again? Huh? What? <laughs> I'm never shooting if the counterweight. This happens to me one more time. <laughs> First that fucking van, and now this. <gasps> huh? <laughs> yep, that looks a little more like what I would expect it. Now this looks like a place fit for cannibals. <laughs> No wonder the cannibals moved to the fake city. <laughs> or Iraq created it, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, God. They're religious. Devastated. Well, yeah, there is a nuclear war. We knew this, Al Albert. Why is the air so <laughs> <laughs> Albert, did, there's a bit of a contradiction here. <laughs> That's what I like about Albert. Glass half full all the time. Yeah. It was? Yeah, right? I should stick to the shadows. Wait, what was that? Until little. That was a ghost. Um Should I save that that little gameplay reveal for next time? Because that's I, weird. I don't okay. Yeah. So, so so just a little hint of what's coming, there will be ghosts. Um well, the spirit of the dead makes it too bright in here. Yeah. Um, I'm in the game. I'm, this is about where I am because I'm stuck on like a boss that's a little after this, but, um, I'm totally confused as to where the plot's going. So, ha the fake city thing, is that being dropped now? I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to tell you. It's like, oh my god, this area had a fake city. Well, let's see what's in the next area. I think I actually mouthed the words, what? When the fake city thing came up? And then it gets really weird in the it's next like each part. each area of the game has its own little plot points and twists, but then when you go to the next area, they're all forgotten about and discarded. I found out, somebody like tweeted me this convert, this like interview, apparently, uh, with the, the company that made the game, and apparently this is originally, they wanted to make it kind of like European Fallout, but the scope was too big, so we just got this. Oh. After fall, it's Saturday. Yeah, it makes sense. 